Hey guys, Alan Denny here. This is Hungry for Heat. Hope everybody is having a really nice long weekend. Tomorrow is July 1st. That's Canada Day here in Canada. And then on the 4th is Independence Day in the States. I want to give a big shout out to the Beach Bar. This is the place I went to last night in Birch Bay, Washington. If you've never been to Birch Bay, never been to the Beach Bar, you need to check it out. Really amazing place. It's a really cool pub, diner, place to go eat, have drinks, watch karaoke, watch live bands. Me and my wife have been going there for years, and there's nothing like it. And Birch Bay is beautiful. So if you've never been there, I don't care where you are. And if you're in Canada, all the way on the eastern side of Canada, or if you're in New York, make your way out to Washington. Look at Seattle, go all the way up I-5, hit Bellingham, go all the way up to Birch Bay and Blaine. Look at Birch Bay and check out the Beach Bar. So this is where I went last night, like I said with my wife. We were uh, celebrating our anniversary, four-year anniversary to be exact. Got married uh, July 4th, 2015. And this place always had the best food, beer and everything. And, and all of a sudden they have this food truck in the back. And uh, we decided to check it out. My wife checked it out first, actually. And it's called the Mobile Mouth Hole. <laughs> I love that name. This is owned by Jesse Owen. There's his contact information. If you want to pause that, make a note of it. He's on Facebook as the Mobile Mouth Hole. And so, like I say, he's a mobile food truck, travels around, goes to different events, different areas. And uh, I always go to the beach bar, you know, and I get my my meal that I always get. I always get the, the, the cheeseburger and the fries, right? And my beer. That's what I always do. She decided to go check out the food truck. I knew it was there from like a month or two ago or something. And I uh, just hadn't checked it out yet. I'm glad she did. Because she got back there and they have um, signs that are talking about try the kiss of death if you're into hot. And uh, we have hot sauces and this and that. And so she's like talking to them saying, oh, what's this about? You know, my husband's really into this. <laughs> So, I'm glad she did that. I went back and checked it out, and um, this Jesse Owen guy, I'm going to give a shout out to you, man. You're really cool. He um, he had this hot sauce that you may have heard of. It's actually an extract. It's in a black coffin. It's a Carolina Reaper extract called Meet Your Maker. And so we had that, showed it to me, and he said he has a challenge that he actually put together. He got Belgian chocolate himself. And put the extract in the chocolate for his challenge, for his mobile food truck challenge. He calls it the kiss of death. One dollar. And he gives you one of these kisses to try to see if you can handle it. And I got a couple of them. All right. So, again, the meat your maker is five million Scoville extract. Um, So here they are, Jesse. You probably recognize them as yours, how you wrap these. Just for verification, these aren't just regular kisses. They do look a bit different, you can tell by the way the wrapper is. And so I am going to unravel one now and see what this mystery is about. Oh yeah, I think you did say something about you put some, some kind of sparkle something on there. Oh, that looks different. Oh, I'm getting it all in my f <laughs> my fingers. Check this out, guys. It actually has a red tip. That's interesting. All right. Looks pretty cool. So to smell, it smells like a Hershey's chocolate kiss. Let's go for it. I can tell you right now, right away, instant heat. Definitely. 
It's down my mouth hole. Gone. I think you got some um, strawberry in there as well. Mixed in with the chocolate. And I can tell you right now, and that dissolves really quickly. It's kind of funny. It's not like Hershey's chocolate at all, where I'm sitting there like chewing on it over and over, you know, and it, well, it's gone. It just dissolved right away, but really good flavor. The good chocolate, Hershey's chocolate flavor. Uh, even though it's not a Hershey's chocolate, it's Belgian, but it tastes the same to me. Uh, the heat. It's present, you know. It's it's there. I can feel it, but it's not getting any hotter. It's staying pretty consistent. It must not be too much that he put in that, but I could say I can tell you this, Jesse. It's it's good. That's good heat for just one of these little guys, though. It is pretty good. I'm waiting to see if it's gonna build or kind of creep up on me. Smack me in my mouth hole. Oh, my lips are starting to burn more. It's a nice beauty of extract. Sometimes it can be a creeper. A deadly creeper. Let's check this one out. Let's see, he's got some glitter on there as well, right? Very interesting. Pretty warm. Yeah, I like that combination of the strawberry and the chocolate. That's really good. I like that heat. That you got behind that too as well guys if um if you never tried this challenge out you have to try it it's really good really good chocolate really good heat that's a great idea jesse the way you put that uh extract in there again this is the mobile mouth hole and that's where you can find them on facebook as well and i like their motto it says uh Food's so good, you'll have to fill your mouth hole. Yeah. Food's so good, you'll have to fill your mouth hole. Sounds like a bad word, you mouth hole. There's the information again. Nose is running a little bit. That's got some heat, Jesse. That's pretty good. I like that. All right, guys. I'm Alan Denny. This has been Hungry for Heat. Thanks for watching. Again, check out Jesse and his business on uh, on Facebook. Check out his events he's going to be going to. Uh, give him a call if you want. Right? Um, send him a message on Facebook. Go to the beach bar if you've never been there. I will be there this summer. I'll be going there as much as I can on my days off. Because there's no place like the beach bar. And you go there and you see what I'm talking about, you'll understand. Thanks for watching, guys. And always remember to stay hungry for heat.